What if Flight Reacts chose college football over entertainment? How would it have been different if Flight actually had the cameras on while playing high school sports? Bro, I would have caught that, bro. I literally caught a pass like that back in eighth grade. I just didn't have the cameras on at the time. We are gonna answer those questions by taking an inside look at how Flight would have looked and played on a college football roster and spectate a few of his games. That's right, Flight Reacts, college football, FTC in the game. But first, let me set the scene. Kamani White is most known for his entertaining reactions here on YouTube and Twitch. And I know for sure I've had my fair share of laughs over the years. Made me happy, made me smile, nice. Not only is he a content creator, man is also a rapper, a hooper, and a football player? Look at Flight Man, so inspirational. Through these clips, we can clearly see that Flight is a natural born two way talent. He's a threat on both offense and defense. Even Cash Nasty had his hands full when going up against Flight in a 1v1. So it was clear to me when I was putting Flight Reacts in the game that I had to find a player that was comparable to his playstyle. And I looked no further than Travis Hunter. Flight has Travis beat in the height department by a couple of inches, but Travis has Flight beat in the size and weight category. Nonetheless, in college, Flight would have played wide receiver and corner. Back. Growing up in West Palm Beach, Florida, I thought it was a fitting choice for FTC to stay local and play for the school 30 minutes north of him up in Boca Raton. That happens to be Florida Atlantic University, the Owls. Hitting the gym, studying the film, and playing a lot of Madden. Flight was just biding his time and waiting for the opportunity to start. So let's fast forward to his senior season, a 76 overall corner and a 64 overall at wide receiver. We can totally work with this. In this video, we will check in and evaluate Flight's impact at four different times throughout the season. The home opener, a key midseason conference matchup, the conference USA championship game, and of course, college football bowl season. Before we jump into game one, I'm gonna need you to drop your predictions down below in the comment section. How many receiving yards and touchdowns will flight end up with does he get an interception on defense and of course keep soaking it up with king sponge for all things college football the stage is set flight reacts in the florida atlantic owls are headed to miami for the season opener this is my type of stadium this is my type of football team we're starting out on defense and we're getting toasted by colby young 18 yards that just can't slide going forward uh, but man our teammate also gets burned by the same dude in miami gets up pretty quick in this one. So I want to turn it around on offense and well, QB forced it to us and uh, <laughs> things are looking shaky to say the least here in our opening drive, offense and defense. FTC needs to get his footing. And so he's going to start it off with a beautiful tackle. Henry Parrish Jr. Get down 23 flight reacts with the big tackle. So uh, at least we're getting on the stat sheet somehow, some way, right? And Parrish, he's surely not going to want revenge for what we've been doing to him. Laying the stick, he's going to be feeling that one. But Parrish gets a little bit of revenge, touchdown. So 14 zip, Miami up. Uh, where was that ball going, QB? I mean, come on, he can't make much of a play when it's out of bounds. But he will snag his first collegiate catch going across the middle of the field. Love to see that. And he's going to come back and do it again. So once you get a feel for how a pigskin feels in your hands, FTC knows what that feels like. And he's going to come out with a slant touchdown. Daniel Richardson gets us the six. And we're right back into this game. So it's been a heck of a first game so far a little bit rough in the beginning but we're coming back in a big way it's all tied up miami's got nothing on us here it's that colby george dude again i'm serious that colby george dude better watch out parish trying to run downhill this game in particular flight reacts and henry parish got all nice and personal rubbing bodies so many times as he goes in to make so many tackles and henry parish just gives it right back they love getting physical here in the trenches gosh and Flight is going to have to try to do it again. Oh, man. Henry is scoring touchdowns. He's making us pay. And all of a sudden, we're down by 14. We're lost in transmission out here. Colby Young, dude, just scores on us like a G. Unfortunately, that's not what FTC wants to see. So he's angry. Lays the hit down on the defender. Sent that brother to the gulag. And this game was all about wraps. We're trying to get one last score just to pad up the stat sheet. But man, look at that acrobatic leap. Flight is so agile, and he leaps but couldn't get it. It wasn't really close because the double coverage and really a bad pass all the round. So uh, with just a minute left in this game, Henry Parrish, nope, it's Van Dyke. So the quarterback even gets in on the action, blows us out. We're 0-1. Are you serious? 
So our back is a little bit in pain after getting blown out, but we got a chance here, mid-season matchup against Tulane. In the interim, we were actually able to go five and three, so Miami for sure was our toughest threat in the beginning. And come on, White, wow. Lay out and just take my breath away. That is some serious acrobatic ability there so 23 gets his big snag in this game early i have to believe the quarterback is going to keep going back to us after showing out like that and yep first and goal let's just top it off why not opening drive touchdown it is a quick six to zero lead over two lanes so the green wave out of new orleans come to town out here in florida so as you saw in the first week against miami we were a little bit shaky on offense and defense but i can tell that flight has been putting in the work throughout the season, and I hope it translates well here in the film because look at that tackle in the early score. I think he's got the skill to really uh, take it up a notch here. This is his first year playing collegiate football, so we got to keep that in mind. But, man, he is all over the defense today, and why not let it fly on offense? So uh, 18 yards on that snag. He's got a little streak here right in between two defenders. Wow, talk about threading a needle. Unfortunately, that drive didn't pan out, but uh, we're up 15-0 nonetheless. And fourth down stop, yep, the boys were there. So defense playing tough later into the season. Uh, but, you know, this is going to be an offensive showcase today from Flight Reacts. One-handed snag. He's definitely done that before with the cameras and without the cameras. So, unfortunately, some shin splints got in the way. Um, he's experienced that in some of his flag football games. So, uh, I know he knows how to come back. Just like that last clip, he scored a touchdown. And he's still playing some tough defense. So, injury or not, he's going to be a threat on the field. And his absolutely lockdown defense is gonna make the quarterback go to other receivers and they get lurked by our teammates so we're all over it today why not add a third touchdown on the game sure 26 yards little leap it's all about ogre now so flight going to town on the green wave we've been the difference maker on offense hands down and let's top it off with 40 seconds left slamming down michael pratt we love getting our hands on the quarterback and them balls so great work there almost getting our first int but i guess that's gonna have to wait till another week nonetheless our team wins the game that's our sixth win on the season we're bowl eligible and in fact a couple weeks later we're right here in the conference usa championship at nine and three, the Owls have been putting in work in fly reacts. Can you tell these routes are getting crispier and crispier by the week? I mean, this drive was all FTC and he's in for a big six. So if you left a comment thinking he's gonna have a big season in collegiate football, well, so far you're looking pretty good um, because flight is getting better week after week. And look at this defense, man. They're just nowhere near. So Conference USA in the books, wrap it up. That's going to send us right into a bowl game with a 10-3 season. This is the New Orleans Bowl out in Louisiana. And we're playing against Western Kentucky, the Hilltoppers. Flight, if you haven't seen that mascot, you have to take a look. He is iconic. Um, so you're going to have your hands full here with a ranked opponent. And, bro, our teammate gets in the way of that route. Flight, you're going to have to get on this guy's head because he just cock-blocked you from a touchdown. I don't know how else to put it. Anyways, Flight... Back on defense here, the dual threat looking to finish off his senior season in style. As flight side of the field continues to be the no-fly zone, let me know if you want to see flight reacts in EA College Football 25. Man, I'm pumped for that game, and I'm going to be bringing so many Dynasty rebuilds and lit content. So uh, keep it here as FTC gets a nice snag and lets his running back do the rest. That's some good teamwork there, man. Uh, but what is this? Flight Reacts about to get a pick. Is he going to actually come down with one before the season's over? And oh man, yes. The answer to that question is yes. The QB tested him. And can I get a heat check? Heat check. Can I get a heat check? Heat check. Uh, can I get a heat check? That's a big play. And Flight is finally got a pick in the books. And it came in the bowl game. So uh, waited till the very last game of his collegiate career to get one. That is something we love to see. Now, all of a sudden, we're down and the quarterback's getting shaky and can't find us as a receiver. Although we had the big pick and the big play on defense, it doesn't matter here because a strip sack fumble, our ball got ripped and the defense took it to the house. And it's about over. 
41 17 last gasp doesn't matter it's all over we're running out of here this game is wrapped so unfortunately dropping the final game of the season and it hurts western kentucky wins but if you guessed in the comment section that ftc was going to have about a 900 yard season nine touchdowns and a pick you would be right subscribe and like i'll see you in the next